love. So today we're going to do another Shein haul. I cannot believe the response that the last video got. I feel like that is like the fastest viewed. I don't know how to say that correctly. It's gotten the most views in the short amount of time of any clothing haul I think I've ever done. So holler for that. Um, it was a completely successful haul. I am very excited to bring you another one and I literally already have a cart built online. I do want to say really quick down below there are affiliate links to all of these items. It would mean the world if you use those links because it does help me. Like I get a very small commission from that and then I'm able to purchase more clothing to do more hauls for you. As you guys know my only income right now is YouTube as I'm in school full-time student. So I any little bit help if you don't want to that's totally cool but if you want to help support this channel it's just a little thing that you can do to help support me and we'll get more clothing hauls out there because I love doing them and you guys seem to really enjoy the clothing hauls um all right I'm gonna stop rambling we're gonna jump into this haul please subscribe if you haven't before you leave let's get into it sizing let's see I am 5'9 almost 5'9 I'm like 5'8 and a half about an 18 on the bottom and about a 16 18 on the top um, I usually go up in sizing, especially at Shein. I will order whatever it is in the biggest size. If you're around my size, like an 1820, I would definitely just order the biggest size. It's going to be the best bet for you. Everything does have measurements. Some items go up to 3X, some items go up to 5X, but I'm going to tell you right now that the 5Xs are the same size as some of the 3Xs. Don't get discouraged if you've ordered some in 5X and those fit and you want to order something in a 3X. If it's the biggest size it goes to, the 3Xs are pretty much the same as the 5Xs. Again, it's hit or miss and definitely think about what you're ordering. I would check the measurements, but also like if the fabric's stretchy and stuff like that, look at the reviews. A lot of people will post pictures. Most of the items that I've ordered, I have checked the reviews and I've only really ordered stuff that had decent reviews. Um, if it says that it runs small, I usually won't order it because I don't want to risk it. But yeah, let's get into this. The first thing we're talking about is the sweater that I am wearing. I did post a fashion post on Instagram. It's a little crop leopard sweater. I'm in love. It's so soft. I honestly, my biggest worry was that it was going to be scratchy and cheap feeling because these clothes are super affordable. Almost like the most expensive thing I think in this haul was $13, which I think is the sweater. Everything's so cheap. But again, it'll all be linked down below. Everything's, there's a whole section of plus size that's under $9.99. And if you are not plus size, the clothes are even cheaper. It's crazy, so affordable. But I just love this little sweater. It's cropped, so I love wearing it with high-waisted jeans. As I can tell you right now, I love this sweater. It's soft. It's like got extra little fuzzies on it. It's just, it's perfect. I don't know. I live for a leopard print. I just live for it. This is cute. You guys know that I love it. I'm obsessed. Um, I would love to have like two of them. Like I wish I had one that was longer, but it's kind of cute that it's cropped. It's definitely different for me. This one I accidentally ordered two of, so I'm gonna give one to my best friend. Um, this is the same top that I had in my last Shein haul that was all black, but this one is the cream and black one. Um, everything comes in these little bags, which is great because when they don't come in little bags, my cats get all over everything. But yeah, this is what this guy looks like. It's got the little strappy top. I know this is not gonna look the perfect with what I'm wearing because I'm wearing a black bra today, so I'm sure in the split screen, you'll be able to see all of that in my black tank top underneath. But I will probably wear a white bra and a white tank top underneath this. Um, it is a little low cut and the straps are not adjustable, but of course you could just put a little stitch if you have a small bust like I do. I do have a really small bust for my size. So that usually is a problem in most clothing for me. I do have to kind of pull it up. Otherwise my whole bra is showing because I don't have the bust to fill up the top. But these fit really nicely. I think this one is in a 5X. Yeah, it's a 5XL. It doesn't say what it's called on the bottom, but again, I'll link it down below. This is just a comfy little cami with lace on it. Super cute. I'm a fan. I don't know how. I almost didn't even order it, and then how I ended up with two. I must have thought that I took it out of my cart and didn't. I don't know. And everything's so cheap, I didn't even notice. Could have gotten something else. Oh, well, hopefully, hopefully Amanda will enjoy it. I like this a lot. It is more clingy because it is white. The material is quite clingy. It feels really comfortable when I'm wearing the black one, um, like the solid black one, even though it kind of does cling, even though I said it didn't cling. I noticed in the video it does cling a little bit um, just because it's so stretchy. So this is cute. I'm definitely gonna wear it with like a cardigan or something because I feel like it just accentuates all of the side chub that I personally don't wanna show off. But if you want it, you do you, boo. You do you, boo. I just know that I'll be more comfortable if I'm wearing cardigan. Plus, it's freaking winter here. We have so much snow outside. So anytime I wear this soon, I'll definitely have to wear it with a cardigan or something. Um, It is quite low. Luckily, you can barely see my bra and the black kind of hides that my bra is black. Um, but I mean, it's super comfy. It just does kind of have a little bit clingy of material because it's white. But there's a lot of room. You can see there's a lot of extra room up here. Um, so it's comfy, it's cozy. I really think these are so cute. I love the black on black. 
I'm obsessed. Um, but if you want a different colored one, they're all cute. You see the little straps? Um, but yeah. Oh, this was super cheap. This was like $7, you guys. It's a little cut out shirt. It looks like it's gonna be a little short. I, I don't know, but it feels like really nice material. It looks like it's gonna fit, like the width is nice. It looks a little boxy, but we'll see what it looks like on. If it's black and it's boxy, it doesn't seem to bother me near as much as the other ones. This one's a 3X. Again, I got this guy for like $7. It's just a little black top. It's got the cutouts up here, which you'll see. I just thought it was basic and cute and I've been intrigued to try it. I'm really impressed with the size of this. Like this actually looks like it could really be a 3X top, maybe a 2X, but how small a lot of the stuff runs on Shein or Romwe and all of the sites that are like that that are super affordable. I'm actually really impressed with how well they have been doing with their sizing. Even if I normally would buy, like at Torrid, I would buy a two. So it seems silly to buy a 5X, but that stuff just runs smaller. So I do, again, the 5Xs are like the same size as a 3X. So don't let that discourage you. Okay, loves, I love this. I love this so much more than I thought I would. This is really cute. It's nice because it's like it's a little bit of a peekaboo, so it's a little bit sexy, but it's not like cleavage. Like I think I can still get away with wearing it to school and stuff. It's cute. It's super comfy. It feels like really comfy, stretchy t-shirt material, um, but it's got this little something extra. I'm not sure how this will wash. That worries me, um, but I think it's really cool, and it's a decent length. It's not as short as I thought it was going to be. Um, here, let me get my tank top up. It still goes to about here, which isn't bad. I mean, I prefer it longer, but with my black tank top, you won't even be able to tell. Uh, yeah, she cute. I like her. $7. Holler. Yes, girl. Ooh, I know you're shocked. There's more leopard print. I'm sorry, guys. I have a problem. Maybe I'm just trying to save the leopard print because someone was like, leopard print is so over. And I was like, no, it's not. Ooh, I don't know about this one. This one does not have any stretch at all to it. So we'll see when I put it on, it might fit, it might not. Let's hope it does. Um, but there's no, maybe it will. I don't know, we'll see. There's no stretch. So, but she's really cute. I love that kind of darker leopard print. Anything with lace, that eyelash lace, look at this. You guys can see like the little hairs that come off of it. That's eyelash lace. I just live for it. I live for it. Um, so I hope this works out. This one does have a sh adjustable straps so that's cool that's a plus um this one is in a 3x what's cool is before i feel like they were outsourcing and now they're doing their own branded clothing maybe i'm crazy but now i'm noticing that almost everything i've ordered actually has a shein tag on it when before there was no tag whatsoever so that's pretty cool. really cute it doesn't have stretch in it though i feel like if it had stretch it would be so much more comfortable it does just fit um and it is extra roomy up here uh, because again, my bust, <laughs> but you can see like the little, look at this. Um, I'm probably going to have to like tack this down or something to keep it in place. I feel like my like was just a little smaller. I would love it even more, but it, I don't think it's terribly unflattering, at least not with these high waisted pants that help kind of suck a lot of this in. Um, but this kind of bothers me that this is doing this. So I feel like maybe if it wasn't so tight, it wouldn't be doing that. Um, and it does look a little janky right here in the middle, but I think if I tack it down, it'll be cute. But it's weird because there's, since there's no stretch, it's like tight on the chub and then loose on the bust. So it's a little different. I mean, I could, this one did have straps that were adjustable, so I could always try that. I'm sure I'll find a way to make it work. That's just my only thing is keep in mind that it's not stretchy. Ooh, this looked really cute. This is a little peplum top. Oh, she's fancy. She's got like a zipper and everything. Wow. She's got adjustable straps as well. It's got that little scalloped edge. I just love that. I must be in right now because I got stuff from Boohoo that had that. This top feels like it's got a little, it's got some stretch. So hopefully this will be cute. That looks really, really low though. Real low. So we'll see, but she's cute. And I say cute too much. I'm sorry, guys. I know I say it way too much, but it's just, you know, when you're shopping and everyone's like, this is cute, this is cute, this is cute. That's how I feel like when I'm pulling stuff out of the bag. I'm like, oh, it's, she's cute. I'm sorry if the word cute offends you, then I don't know how to stop. <laughs> but this looks really pretty. I'm excited to try it on. The smaller straps are the straps for the shirt. And then this is like my bra and my tank top underneath. Um, It is quite low, but not as low as I expected it to be. Um, It's a little shorter than I expected it to be, but I'm also very tall. So again, 5'9", roughly. It's very comfortable. It's very stretchy. I feel like the raw edges on this don't look super high end, but 
it was under $10, I'm pretty sure. So I will definitely wear this. I feel like it'll be really cute with a little waist belt. I just love high-waisted peplums. Like I love peplums with waist belts. I feel like it just accentuates my waist and that's how I prefer to wear them. Plus I feel like it'll push up my bust a little bit. So <laughs> it'll make it look like I have a bigger bust than I do. So it'll fill out this top a little more. It's cute that it flares out like that though. Like it really is a true peplum. I feel like a lot of peplums don't look like that. I don't know a lot that I've tried just kind of go down. Um, but I like that it's got like it actually goes out. And I think that'll accentuate even more with a waist belt. So I think this is cute. Definitely if you're looking for like a little going out top, the back's really cute with the straps across. It goes pretty low. Oh, really low. That's my tank top. So she goes pretty low. So you definitely want to either wear it with a jacket or with a different bra or no bra. I mean, you do you, boo. Um, this fits a little weird in the armpits. Again, it might just be because my bust is not very big. Um, maybe it's just extra. But it's nice that that's like secure, that you're not gonna have like your armpit chub hanging out. I don't know. It's not like my favorite thing I've ever gotten in my life, but it's definitely cute and I'll definitely wear it. It's functional. I thought there was more than this. There's, I think this is the last item. I think it's because I accidentally ordered the same top twice. Um, but I'm excited to see this little sweatshirt type thing. The reviews were pretty decent. It does have some strings hanging off of it. So just keep that in mind. I probably paid nine bucks or something for this. Maybe this was one of the more expensive items. But I have to tell you, this is so much softer than I thought it was going to be. It's just a black pullover 3X. Again, it's branded with the Shein tag, which is cool. Um, this is really soft. I have to tell you that I am just so impressed with the quality of these, like given there are some strings hanging off, but the actual quality of this shirt, like the fabric, the material they're using feels really, really nice. And especially compared to my Romway haul, which there was debate, there's debate all over. I got told so many times that Romway and Shein were the same company and a lot of the same items are on them. I think that's because they're both outsourcing. Maybe they're connected. I don't know. I don't know. I have to say that Shein is completely like the quality level of the Shein stuff I've got has been so, so much better than anything I got from Romway. Anything. Even the stuff that I really liked from Romway, I feel like the stuff from Shein is so much better and the prices are the same. And you can always Google a coupon code. I don't personally have one. I know tons of blush has one. I think it's Sarah Ann 20. Um, but if you just Google it, you can usually find some sort of coupon code on a, in addition to the affordability of the clothing. And I believe it's free shipping over 50. Um, so. For a plus size girl, this is really exciting because it's so hard to find affordable quality plus size clothing. And it's funny because I just feel like Shein has completely just switched ends of the spectrum. Like they went from being so cheap and everyone said bad stuff about them. And now I'm just like completely blown away, you guys. It feels so soft. I cannot wait to try it on. Okay, I love this. I love this. I love it. It's so comfy. Um, It is thinner than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was gonna be more like a sweatshirt material judging by the images on the website, but you never know. Uh, the sleeves are nice and long. They're nice and roomy. I really, really like this. I don't feel like it's too clingy or anything. I feel like it just fits nice. Like it's perfect. Perfect. It's a great length for me, even on tall. It goes up a little higher on the sides, but then it swoops in the top, in the front and the back. Uh, to cover your booty. Oh, uh, so I'm feeling it. She comfy. I think I'm just gonna leave this on for the rest of the night. All right, loves. Well, that is everything that I picked up from Shein. Please let me know down below if you would like another Shein haul or do you want another Boohoo haul? Where do you want to haul from next? Um, hopefully somewhere affordable. It's much easier for me to do Shein hauls because it is so affordable. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and share it if you could. This does help me out so, so much. Please subscribe if you have not already. I upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday here on my channel. I will talk to you soon. Bye. Let's do this. Let's do do it. Let's do it. What am I saying? What am I doing? What is my life? Hello. Luna is digging in the bag right now. Can I have this sweet thing? Please and thank you. I'm gonna hold this because she will play with it. But don't get to start this. What? That's cute though. I mean, I got it on. Sometimes that's just the positive, you know? Wow. Oh, she's kind of low. How does this? What am I doing? I'm just a consumer buying stuff. You can see my widow's peak. What's up? Because these, my banks are always crazy. I can never get them under control.